Irvine, Philadelphia has a massive cleanup job this morning. Peaceful demonstrations over the death of George Floyd ended yesterday in the city with police officers hurt, cars set on fire and businesses vandalized. Now the curfew for the city is over for the time being. Eyewitness News reporter Dan Koob is live in Center City where much of the destruction is visible. Dan, good morning. Good morning, Jan. There is a lot of visible destruction and there are a lot of visibly distraught people who live in this city who are now coming out after 7 o'clock to assess it for themselves. But I want to show you behind me the Urban Outfitters who were here about an hour and a half ago. You can see just how much damage has been done to this building. People are coming out, taking pictures of the damage to see for themselves. You can see coat hangers all over the ground, clothing all over the ground, charred remains of mannequins all over the ground here on the corner of 17th and Walnut. As I mentioned, people now coming out to take pictures for themselves, to see it for themselves. I want to go to a soundbite from our mayor, Jim Kenney, from last night. Acts of violence and destruction are never justified. We will get through this. We will continue to hold bad cops accountable, and we'll hold those who committed these acts today accountable also. Now we're crossing the street, we're crossing 17th and Sansom to give you a look at some of the other things that are going on down here, Jan. You see Lucky Brands Company, half of this window has been completely broken out. There are mannequins thrown everywhere. You can see this place has been looted. We have seen looters throughout the morning, not only here on Sansom Street, or on Walnut Street rather, but on Sansom Street we've had reports of looting going on at 15th and Chestnut all over the city this morning. I mentioned the juxtaposition in the last half hour of people going for jogs, walks with their dogs, with their spouses, significant others, while people just down the street are looting. That has subsided where we have been a little bit as more people are now coming out to take pictures and assess for themselves, but it's still a bad scene down here, Jan. If you can avoid the area, I would do so. We'll go back to you. Yeah, just an incredible sight. Okay, Dan, we'll see you again at 8 o'clock. Thank you.